it's the music's fault and the cider. Yeah. I just want to make you mine. In May 2022, we travelled to Elvington Airfield for the first ever Van Love Fest. In June 2023, we were back. So if you like vans, e-bikes, a few drinks and some 90s dancing with friends, then stay with us and we'll take you through Van Love Fest 2023 right to the end of the weekend with the amazing runway van convoy. But before that, we had 220 miles to travel from Swindon all the way up to the airfield just south of York. Everything kicked off on Friday morning and we wanted to be there bright and early. Me, is it rush hour? Good evening and welcome back to the channel from an almost dark Yorkshire. I assume we're in Yorkshire. Anyway, we've travelled for the last four or five hours to get as close as we can to Van Love Fest tomorrow. So we came back to the same park up that we did last year, which is the Georgian Dragon. However, this year, it's completely shut, look. So I had my heart set on a cheeky little cider just before they closed, but um, turns out we missed them. So we've parked up just behind me, look, tucked away. There's a couple more vans uh, this year. We were on our own last year. So uh, Dora's got some food on, although we did have a cheeky McDonald's on the way up because uh, I'd seen they've got a Biscoff McFlurry and there's no way I was missing out on that. And it was good, although half of it's still in the freezer, so I'm going to have that in a minute. And uh, yeah, we're going to get our heads down uh, to continue our journey tomorrow morning as we make our way to Van Love Fest. So we'll catch you in the morning. Good morning, we've survived another night at the Georgian Dragon. I've got my coffee, look, so that's okay. What isn't okay is I've been banished to the bedroom so Dora can use the whole length of the van to look at herself in the mirror while she does her hair. Anyway, the bin lorry is outside, uh, which is always nice. So um, I think that's our cue to go. Hopefully Dora will get her act together. I'm gonna down this and then we'll be on the road where van love, here we come. Off she goes, look. Cheeky McDonald's breakfast. It's not good, is it? The second McDonald's in the last 15, 16 hours. It's not the way forward. When you're on the road though, and you want something quick, um, you can't beat a McDonald's, and you definitely can't beat a double sausage and egg McMuffin. So crack on, Dora, then we can hit the road again. How is it? Really nice. Yeah? Yeah, I found a new taste sensation with Warburton's Square Baps. Who doesn't like a square bap? <laughs> there is something about a double sausage and egg McMuffin you just can't beat. Some crazy people have bacon, ba bacon and egg, but it doesn't even come close. Let us know in the comments, are you a bacon and egg McMuffin or a sausage and egg McMuffin kind of person? This is why it always takes us forever to get anywhere because we always end up getting sidetracked. Um, Dora's still going. She is the world's slowest eater as well. Come on. I just take my time. I enjoy my food. I've enjoyed mine. Now I'm ready to go. Savour it. Right, let's get a show on the road. We've arrived, we're about an hour early, and we're in the outer queue, but I think we'll be all right. They've got quite a bit of room to park people in this uh, outer queue before we get let in at 12. Van Love Fest 2023. Keep it locked to Van Love Radio. Right, 
Right, we've been and said hello to everybody. Um, it's getting warm now, which is good. It's not a complaint. We've got Dora in the background here, look. She's on lunch duties. What are we having? We're having tuna sandwiches. Tuna sandwiches. We've got the DJ in the background for a bit of live music action. Uh, and then are we gonna go and explore then? Yeah. Yep, yeah, so quick tuna sandwich. Cup of tea? Go on then, you can oh, make it. We're rock and roll, aren't we? Aren't we rock and roll? What, I'm making it? Apparently I'm making the tea, tuna sandwich, and then we're going out and about to explore. We'll catch you then. Well, I'd like to put it out there right now. I have a rarity here. I don't have a YouTube channel. It's a game of two halves here. Friday night, we're expecting Rosala on quite shortly. And it's still quite warm, but it's raining. So hence I've got a hat on to keep the rain off, a dry robe, but also just a t-shirt because I'm actually quite hot. It's very confusing weather. because the local council want us to be nice and quiet, okay? So the main stage is finished, and this, my friends, is what a silent disco looks like. I do look a bit crazy. No, I'm gonna reel with you, that's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. We were never really fans of a silent disco, but when Shawnee put her headphones on our heads, it just did something to us. You can't explain it, you just know you need a pair. So it's Friday night, it is now, oh, it's 23 minutes past midnight. You know it's been a good night when you've got a head torch on. I need to go to the loo, so I'm gonna to go to the, uh, the port to lose. So I need, um, need some, some lighting. Yeah, our loo's got to last the weekend, so he has to use the outside one. Unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> Ladies only inside. Mm. Anyway, anyway yeah. it's been a great day. We saw Rosala and she was so good. Her voice is absolutely brilliant she was so kind and did loads of selfies um and it's now time for bed we've just been called losers uh by the last people standing in the middle of the over there 
so we're going to call it a night now and we'll pick up with you in the morning On Saturday morning, there was a few sore heads around, I can tell you, and the weather was stifling. But we had a drone fly over, followed by some well-being sessions, and then a My Rider giveaway. Then it was the limbo competition, and we then had a steel band to celebrate the Hawaiian theme. There was a conga, and then it was soon enough time for the silent disco once again and it went down an absolute storm. Welcome to Sunday morning. I've just knocked up a couple of bacon sandwiches ready for us to hit the convoy down the runway for Van Love Fest 2023. We haven't got long, have we? We've got 25 minutes before the queue starts. Okay, so we need to get this eaten up and get ready, everything packed up. It's been a great weekend, hasn't it? We haven't filmed terribly much because we've been having too much fun. Mm. Yeah, another cracker. Yeah, really good. Right, let's do this. fair few fans that have gone already they've missed the best bit of the weekend and it is this bunch of reprobates gonna say goodbye <laughs> so much for coming uh, it's been just a genuinely awesome weekend there's way too many people to thank but i've nearly lost my voice so i'm going to say no more other than the clue is in the name of van love we're all about loving each other it's very easy to write nasty things online be critical don't do it love each other be positive share the love if you do we might just come back next year. Thank you so much. Enjoy the convoy. We'll see you very soon. See you next time. We're intended to leave that there. 